Smart devices that hook up to the internet and can be controlled by your phone. Those will be hot items this holiday season. Yes, indeed. And tonight, these devices are the focus of a demonstration you really need to see. Five on your side investigator Jonathan Walsh shows us just how easy it is to hack your home. Well, I can see who's in the driveway and who's coming up the front walk and who's at the front door. Gloria Bevan has a ring camera system, a smart TV, and a wireless printer. She's worried about just how exposed she is. I don't like that you have access to what I'm doing in my house. So we started with one of Gloria's neighbors. We are in an undisclosed location in our mobile unit. Our ethical hacker, Rob, is going to show us how it's done. A lot of these things can be done pretty easily. Rob Simon has been hacking for years. He tells us a simple tossed out light bulb can trash your personal accounts. We can pull the internals of that out and then we can look for the flash memory chips that are on there that store all of the information as well as the settings for connecting to your network. He extracted potentially damaging info like passwords, all with the help of this. You can get this anywhere? Yeah, you can get this anywhere. This is just a cheap device. It costs about $15. While sitting in our van, Rob was able to gain control of this thermostat using just commonly known passwords. Not only can he create problems with freezing out the home, but it's a high-tech way of casing the house using the calendar on the thermostat. Maybe he's scheduling a lower temperature than you would typically use for, say, about a week. It might be possible that the user is going to be on vacation during that time, so they might not be home. Funny thing is, the house Rob just hacked belongs to Alex Hammerstone from Trusted Set, who helped us with this demonstration. If you use the same password across multiple sites, your account is only going to be as secure as the weakest site where you use it. Problems are prevalent. Data breaches are happening all the time, affecting millions of people's private info. People are paying to get this type of information. There's always going to be people out there that are going to be doing it. Plus, a quick Google search shows hacking courses popping up in under a second. We found hackers' presentations on YouTube. Hack all the things, 20 devices in 45 minutes. It's such a massive worldwide issue that hits the U.S. hard. It's like you know, leaving your uh, blinds open and uh, a bunch of people looking in at you. A previous Five on Your Side investigation found a website that's hacked into thousands of cameras online for anyone to see. Medical procedures, a naked man, and children. Plenty of them in schools, in daycares, and at home. We found a local victim whose home camera was hacked. Should have been very much more diligent about realizing it's a window into your home. With so many internet connected products out there, even microwaves, vacuums, and door locks, the experts say it's time for all of us, not just Gloria. Especially for older people like me, we don't really know what we're doing with this stuff. To use protections like multi-layer authentication, where a text can tell if it's you in an account. That's gonna help prevent someone from gaining access, even if they did have your credentials. And pay a lot more attention to our internet connected products. People oftentimes think of their technology devices like a toaster which you buy, you use for 20 years, and then you get another one. But really, it's a lot more like a car. It requires updates and maintenance. So let's close the door on the criminals. I'm Five On Your Side investigator, Jonathan Walsh.